Welcome to the AutoPulse NXT Resuscitation System in-service video series. This multi-part series provides detailed information about the AutoPulse NXT mechanical CPR device and its functionality. This series serves as an adjunct to formal training. Please take time to read the user guide available at zoll.com. Proper use of the system requires a thorough understanding of the product, appropriate training, and practice. In this overview module, we review the components of AutoPulse NXT. The components include the AutoPulse NXT platform, the AutoPulse NXT band, the batteries, and battery charger. The AutoPulse NXT accessories include the shoulder restraint, a hygiene barrier, and for transporting AutoPulse NXT, the hospital transporter. Let's begin by reviewing the key features of the AutoPulse NXT platform. The platform includes two user control panels, a battery port, a USB port, vents for air intake and output, anchor points for a shoulder restraint, a yellow line for patient alignment, and a band guard port on each side of the platform for attaching the AutoPulse NXT band. We'll learn more about the functionality of these features in separate modules. The AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system includes a hygiene barrier. The hygiene barrier is a plastic cover that helps reduce contamination during use. Learn more about how to apply it in the module entitled Hygiene Barrier. Now let's review the AutoPulse NXT band. When attached to the platform, the AutoPulse NXT band automatically adjusts to fit the patient's chest, determining the appropriate depth and force for each compression. The AutoPulse NXT band attaches to either side of the platform. Learn more about how to install it in installing and removing the AutoPulse NXT band. The shoulder restraint is another important component of the AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system. It attaches to the platform at the shoulder restraint anchor points to help maintain patient alignment during treatment. AutoPulse NXT is powered by a rechargeable lithium ion battery that provides a typical runtime of 30 minutes of continuous use. We'll learn more about installing and charging the battery in the modules Battery Installation and Removal and Battery Management. We have now reviewed the key components of the AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system. We will explore the device's functionality and how to prepare AutoPulse NXT for use in other modules in this series.